this is Lou, uh, here on location at Cheap Metal Supply in Chicago. Today I'm going to be working on a, a corner detail for a Rheinzang flat lock tile. As we go through it, I'll show you some of the basics on how to get involved in making the corner uh, with a corner post, making a corner without a corner post. Starting off with our base rail. Easier for me at, at this point to use this nice little tool that we have here. It's a Freund notching tool. It gives me an elongated hole. It's easier. It's like a little punch to be able to push through the, the material. Zinc having a high coefficient of expansion and contraction. I'm going to put the screws directly in the center so if that, that thing moves back and forth, it actually will stay engaged. Longest portion of the job, peeling all the plastic off. Install that panel. Like I said, it's a left to right install and just hooks it right in place. I have one prefab, but I'll show you exactly how we'll get that panel to. So I'm going to take the panel, I'm going to lock it in place. Kind of gives me an idea where I need to be. I'm going to mark the panel on both top and the bottom areas, so that way for my fold. From that position, I'm going to pull that panel there and understand where I am on the bottom. And the bottom is going to be a little different than the top. The top's going to be straight cut. Bottom is going to be a notch. If I pull that panel out there, I'm going to take my notches. I'm going to notch that panel at that top there so that my fold. And on the bottom, I'm going to get a base on the 45. Drop that panel down. And then bring it straight up and directly into place. Taking my next panel. And it comes right at the corner. So my next piece that I'm going to make, I'm going to actually make it and I'm going to have it fold all the way around the corner for that area there. I'm getting the screws in. So typical field stuff, you can take a look at it and get your corner to where you want it to be, so that that's level. From here, take the rule, find out what the distance is there. It's about 30, it's about 40 millimeters. Taking my roller, go right at 40 to bend that corner. So if I try to slide this down, I should be able to hook that in place. So what I'll do is I'll open this up just to here, just to be able to get it started. And I should be able to slide that straight down. Hooking it all the way, hooking it all the way. Hooking it there, hooking it there. And where am I stuck? Locked in place. Taking my hand tool there. And that's a fabricated corner without using a corner post and using just your panels by hand. 